Dr. Z, and today we're going to do a new procedure. It's a microneedling procedure with no heat. I like this procedure because it's a, from the microneedling devices in the past, they caused too much trauma to the skin surface, and they caused new blood vessels on the skin surface called neovascularization and gave you some unwanted redness. So I like this. This is new, and it has um, microneedling that goes to a depth that helps cause some tissue tightening. So we're going to do it on my abdomen today for some tissue tightening. So stay tuned. Let's see. All right, so we're going to get started. So I have had numbing medicine on my abdomen for about an hour. So it'll be, it won't be very painful when we do the procedure. We're fixing to get started. We are doing a microneedling treatment today on Dr. Z's abdomen. So what we're trying to accomplish with this is uh, skin tightening really. We want to tighten the skin, make sure it looks more smooth, um, gives a better quality to the skin. She has no discomfort whatsoever. We did topical numbing cream for about an hour before the treatment. We'll have a little bit of pinpoint bleeding, a little redness, mild, mild swelling after the treatment for maybe a day or two. The recovery is really nice. It's very quick. Um, mild sunburn feeling. I wouldn't even say for 30 minutes after the treatment. But you can see where we're getting a little bit of pinpoint bleeding right there. So that's exactly what we're looking for. And then we'll move on to the next section. All right, so now we're working on another section of the abdomen. And I have been using Cool Tone, another procedure that we have at the office to help tighten my abdominal muscles. So I've been doing the Cool Tone, you do two treatments, a week for two weeks and then you go into a maintenance phase and I have done that for about the last two months and you may be able to see it in the video but my abs are sculpted more than they used to be. Okay here we go this is our we're at the end of our treatment. You can see mild redness, a little pinpoint bleeding, um, but the tissue looks great. Um, she should be very comfortable for the rest of the day. A little bit of tenderness, but nothing that is gonna stop her from doing whatever she needs to do today. We're gonna clean her up real good and put a little post-procedure cream on her and she'll be good. No hot baths for 24 hours and clean the area twice a day and we'll give you post care and make sure you know all the right things to do.